Yo, what's up guys, Memory here. Today I'm making a response video to a famous BB Tag player known as Zykun. Who is Zykun you may be wondering, and what is he infamous for? Zykun is a poor sport in the BB Tag community that spent the past two years verbally harassing players for beating him online. Harassing, complaining about playstyles he can't tolerate. If you're lucky, you'll catch him in Lobby 1 bitching for hours. And if you really piss him off, he'll spam you in your DMs. No GG, no props, nothing like that. Just straight up disrespect and more profanity. And the reason why this community doesn't mass support his ass and ban him from PSN, it's cause it's funny as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, somebody clip that! Somebody clip that! Somebody clip that! Somebody clip that! <laughs> this nigga is a 21 year old man child that calls this game a fan service bait game, yet still plays it only to look down on players that are better than him? No one takes him seriously because he's so stupid. Five years later, and this moron doesn't know that the PlayStation 4 controllers have a share button. When you rage quit, you give people receipts to clown on you. Hold up, let me just explain how I even met this clown in the first place. Apparently, I beat him in a match at some point last summer. I, I didn't give enough of a fuck to save the match, so I'm assuming my win wasn't a big deal. But to Zai, I stomped him out, ragdolled him, and took him out like the trash he probably was, because the only fights I remember is from my competition. He sent me this seven page essay on why he doesn't want to adapt to other people's playstyles, mashing is apparently bad, he doesn't care about winning, but is crying that he lost to mashing, okay now I'm confused. Apparently giving up in the middle of the match is fine, and us disconnecting was just a coincidence. Oh so that's what happened? You disconnected in the middle of our fight? Oh well, th that explains why I didn't really remember it. It was so pathetic. Also, he wants me, a complete stranger, to give a shit about what he's been through, but can't take the L like the man he legally is. And encourages me to be like every other gamer he's harassed in the past, who are 100% in their right, mind you, to expose him on social media for being pathetic. <laughs> well, thank you for giving me permission to roast you, because I ain't done yet. Get cozy. After seeing the 7 paragraph permission slip of sorts, I shared it in my video of who's the hardest character to learn in BB Tag. As an example, mind you. I felt the reason why Zai was so salty was because Noelle's inputs are much easier than Naoto's. This is an opinion that I'm sure a lot of people would back up. However, I didn't know at the time that everyone in my fan base already knew this guy. He's a prick to everyone. Just look at all these messages. So apparently he took this 5 second clip to heart and he started bickering with his past enemies in my comment section. 77 comments long, god damn, read at your own risk. <laughs> now before I share the next receipt, I want everyone that's new to me that clicked on this video out of curiosity, with anyone I engage with for the first time, I approach them with respect. I use diplomacy first, so when the receiving party takes my kind proposal to cease fire, wipes their ass with it, slams it in my face, then I go on. I wished him good health, told him to find happiness, bid him a good day, and he was shocked. A man's here felt guilty, he said he held no grudge, didn't want misfortune to come my way, and even called me remarkable for being entertaining, only to backpedal a month later saying in order for him to let it go, he wants a rematch, and if he wins, I gotta delete my video. Dude, this motherfucker! you just told me that you didn't care about winning- oh my god. This guy is an imbecile. After that shit, I just gave up caring, dude. Like, who the fuck is this guy? I don't owe him anything. Zai, if you are watching this, let me tell you something. Because you actually should feel ashamed of yourself. Raiden, you guys all remember this guy. He's actually the one that introduced me to all the competition and amazing friends that I have now that made this series a success and expanded this community by roughly 600 people in the span of five months. Now tell me something. How the fuck? Did this teenager make more of an impact in this community than you did in two years? Exactly. That's why he's the GOAT! Let's go! But seriously, that shit is embarrassing. After a half a year when I ignored you, you still coming back talking crap after I got finished fighting with one of my homies, sitting there asking for a rematch and shit. Okay, first of all, I'm not fighting your dumb broke ass because you can't afford a decent internet connection. Your internet cables are literally around 12 bucks. Go get a job. And even if your internet connection was good, you can't even handle Fearless. What makes you think that you stand a chance against me? And another person that you also harassed. 
Then after I take off, my friend is just sitting here just watching you talk. You're still bitching about me after I left? Like, dude, you're not a fucking kid. Grow the fuck up. As soon as I found out that you were 21, dude, I could not believe all the shit that I was seeing online. And if you really do have mental illness, get help. Yo, real talk, everyone that still plays BB Tag, or just any fighting game in general, if you see this account again, or any account just raging at you at this level, text get help, leave a viable number for them to call, bow, and walk away. With my community as my witness, I swear to God, Zai, this is the last time I'm ever gonna acknowledge you, man. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day, and see you never.